I just didn't like my <sighs> guys. <laughs> I just didn't like how I looked. Period. I just didn't like. It. I I didn't understand. It, to be quite honest. And yes, my desires about baby. Um, say you know I'm saying like you the girl, but I just didn't feel like I was. A girl. everyone and welcome back to my youtube channel for those who don't know me Ikamalam Dengobalisa and I'm here to share my eczema journey if it's your first time tuning in welcome I really do hope that you like this video please do not leave without subscribing so that you can be part of the family and if you are a returning subscriber what do you do sweetie so today is another ranting session so let's just go into it okay <laughs> So as you know, self-esteem is basically like your overall opinion about yourself, like how you value yourself, self-worth, how you see yourself. Don't get on doing it too. So um, that's not to say that like I didn't know that I was beautiful. No, I, I am beautiful. <laughs> like I knew I'm beautiful. I knew that um it just so happened that my skin is unique it's not the same as everybody else i knew that i got a beautiful body i knew that i'm blessed blessed going in blessed going out let me not preach <laughs> but like i knew all the good things right but it does not like it doesn't change the fact that eczema affected the way i saw myself because of what i was seeing externally what i was seeing on my skin get me i hope i'm making sense so because of like the flare outs obviously and the pigmentation and like the pimples it's not even pimples like i don't even know what to call them child because it starts off as pimples and then it goes to this huge black thing but the spots and just everything on my body i just didn't like how i looked because it was down bad guys my leg <laughs> it was down bad so um eventually when my skin obviously started filling up and then it got severe severe um yes good thing is that it was online schooling then so i didn't like have to go out go to school and come back so people didn't really see my skin but there was a time where i had to go do my practicals and it was tough but even just going to the mall, even just going out to the shops and stuff like that, for me, it would be like a big thing because I just do want to go outside. If I have to go outside, I would just prefer to cover myself because I just was not comfortable with people seeing how I look. Because your yeah, bands are also like, bands are and then they feel pity for you. And they're like, oh, shit, you ex and I'm like, no, shit, hey. <laughs> or like they just uh, or send us a or any or they just want to diagnose you or they want to tell you no try this i'm just like uh so i'd just rather cover up so anyway um as time went on and also especially because now eczema started um coming on my face because eczema before never did that like we did not play here sweetie we did not touch the face so when it started doing that like you guys i broke down because i said this face card how <laughs> how and you can't hide the face and obviously then i couldn't also put um what is this makeup i know people i know there are people who cover the eczema by using makeup and it works for them but personally i'm not even like a huge makeup person i'll just put makeup like when i'm going out there and there but also, I just felt like if I put eczema, it's just going to make it worse either way. Because eczema just it makes my skin itchy and it makes my skin dry. So, uh, and I don't even have the time. I'm also not like so good at makeup. So, I was just like, oh, I am Dagabao. Uh, uh, let me just stay at home. But uh, yeah, so it affected my self-esteem because I just didn't like how my skin looked. I didn't even like looking at myself in the mirror, guys. Like, I didn't even like bathing because every time I had to bath, like how feel how bumpy my skin is how flaky it is you guys like it was a mission like there were days where i just wished like you know someone can bath me someone can just moisturize my body and my mom used to do that sometimes when i ask her and i'm just like today i'm just not having it 
then after i'm done bathing i'll just go to her and then she'll like moisturize my whole skin shout out to my mom like shout out to you mom because uh like i, I could have been dead <laughs> i honestly would have been dead with my mom but anyway that's besides the point um i don't know also now how to dress yamona so it's summer and now kushushu, obviously i can't be wearing like jerseys jackets and stuff like that so now it's a huge thing every time i have to go out making oh my god and also like i love jeans now but also i just felt like now it came to a point where i'm forced to wear jeans because i didn't want i don't like wearing dresses because i have like spots on my legs and i just didn't like how it looks <sighs> like people were living their best lives and i'd go out like with my sisters and my cousins like we would be the girls that we thought we were we are those girls okay <laughs> so they would um wear uh what is this short dresses um shorts even if it's just like a a, a long dress but you're only cute and i i was just not that person i don't want to show my arms i don't want to show my legs mix so i'll usually just wear jeans and then i'll i'll try and wear like a long sleeve top but also what helped me quite a lot is like the mesh tops so i was good to go with those i just brought my cousins and my sisters and that's what i would wear most of the time so like guys yo oh, i mean it was bad and then there was times where i never told my cousins this and my sister so <laughs> if they say this it will literally be for the first time but i've told my mom so there were times where because every time we'd go out right uh, my sister and i would go home would go to my cousins right and then we'll prepare there we'll go and sleep over and then we leave from there go out and then come back right so there were times where I, I would feel like they being insensitive but not because they are being insensitive but to me it would just feel like about understanding and not understanding that moment like we're just all excited women were cute and all but for me it was more than that so there were times where like if i get genium, like we just take out clothes and we're like okay what you gonna wear because obviously we'll start off with makeup then i take out my things and i'm like oh, why, why are you wearing that oh no wear this wear this dress and stuff and then i'll be like no guys i'm not gonna wear that and then they're like why go shoo shoo and i'm like no i don't feel comfortable with showing my skin yeah, and they're like but your skin is not so bad and i'm like yeah to you it's not that bad but to me that's not how i feel yeah, and it's gonna be pointless if i wear like a short dress short yo girl <laughs> it's gonna be pointless if i wear a short dress right and then i'm not comfortable like groove or i'm not comfortable wherever we go yeah but i'm just gonna feel uncomfortable and at the end of the day i'm just gonna wanna go home so i just felt like my very virginia and my long sleeve tops like if i'm brave enough sometimes i would just wear uh, a long dress then at least i'm covering my legs but then i'll show my arms so it was just a like it was a pick your battle type of thing so sometimes i'd rather just show my arms sometimes i'll just show my legs but it, i wouldn't wear like short dresses like never so that's how eczema affected my self-esteem i just didn't like how i looked anymore honestly and also because of the weight thing um i just didn't like my guys <laughs> i just didn't like how i looked Period. i just didn't like I I didn't get a to be quite honest. And yes, when is that about baby um say you know I'm saying like you the girl but I just didn't feel like I was a girl and it was okay for me to to feel like that because yes obviously um self esteem guys yeah dependent because also it's influenced by a lot of things so we can't really say your self-esteem will stay at like one level for your entire life so even if okay let's say like the average um level had to be 50 there'll be times where it's like 40 then there's times where it's like 60 it depends right because it's how you see yourself and it's influenced by obviously how people see you compliments that people give you the looks that people give you also you affirming yourself don't get no domain it's a lot and not to say that um my my cousins my my siblings or my mom like my family in general not that they were not um not that they were not sensitive men to the situation and not that they didn't like 
affirm me and stuff because obviously we would dress up we'll take pictures and we'll all bump each other like oh girl you look cute you look cute and all of those things but it's just the thing of like i did not feel good so even if people would compliment me and stuff it would be like uh, okay sure whatever like no, it's fine i didn't feel like so great about myself like yes there were days even makeup for me it was like a mission because i would have like or something and then i have to apply makeup on it sometimes i feel like even if i put makeup my the dark spots are still visible like nothing was just helping so my self-esteem got affected like that it was just going <laughs> down <laughs> but now the game is up period the girl is back okay i feel good about myself now i'm sure you guys can see because also yeah, papa. my skin is not perfect i still have spots i still struggle there and there but um literally i think it i only started last year towards the end of the year wearing like short things now Kwana, it's not like so short so i'll wear like um you see those what do you call them short dresses yeah those things and like dresses that like come up to my knees i haven't worn like short shorts or okay i've worn a mini skirt so i'm trying literally i'm i'm trying by the day even now i can't wait for spring so that you know i can show some legs anyway moral of the story eczema did affect my self-esteem and um i'm just trying to get my groove back to be quite honest yeah when I, i'll be posting hopefully Depends. also taking pictures is another thing guys there's so much incident but i can't wait for spring show my legs there and there as i've said so eczema affected my self-esteem ganja okay guys and uh i try by the day you know, to affirm myself so this day sometimes i'll wear something short i look at myself and i'm like mm -mm, i don't like it and i'm just like mm -mm, but that's what they that's what they and sometimes i just change sometimes i'm like you know what just go just go so day by day we're, we're taking it step by step by step step by step it's a whole journey at the end of the day so that is it for today i know i blabbed a lot but thanks for coming to my ted talk <laughs> i really do hope that you enjoyed my video please don't forget to give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video don't forget to comment down below guys like bump me there by the comment section you know say congratulations let's go out and wear shorts and be the girls and the boys that we think that we are okay and last but not least don't forget to subscribe to my channel so that you can be part of the family that was it for today bye